One thing I love about the Apostle Paul, he just wouldn't quit. And there's a great example of Paul's endurance for us today in Acts chapter 14. Now it happened in Iconium, verse 1, that they went together to the synagogue of the Jews and so spoke that a great multitude, both of the Jews and the Greeks, believed. But the unbelieving Jews stirred up the Gentiles and poisoned their minds against the brethren. Then later, the Jews and the Gentiles in the city united, planning to stone Paul and Barnabas. So they fled and began preaching the gospel in Lystra. But the Jews from Antioch and Iconium had followed them there. And once again, they stirred up the multitudes. This time they stoned Paul and left him for dead outside the city. Nevertheless, Paul rose up when the disciples gathered around him. After preaching the gospel to that city and making many disciples, they returned again to Lystra, Iconium, and Antioch. Now this is interesting. Paul went back to the city where he was stoned and to the towns where his enemies lived. But that's not the end of the story. We're told later that God used these circumstances to open the door of faith to the Gentiles. Paul wouldn't quit preaching the gospel and God used it to spread the gospel outside the Jewish people. Aren't you thankful for the faithful endurance Paul displayed in sharing the gospel? As we read Acts 14 today, let's ask God to help us share the gospel with endurance, just like Paul did.